1955, in the fall of 1955, a scandal broke. Boys had created a male youth prostitute circle. Suddenly it was portrayed, this is infecting our community. They were concerned about illegal activities and how it would affect their teenage sons. No, there may be 100 to 125 boys involved and we don't know how many adults. It did not seem possible that this community ever harbored homosexuals to ravage our youth. It seemed like once it started, it was like a, an avalanche. It just started and it gained momentum. Of the six actually arrested so far, all have been accused of acts with minors, but the eventual consequence hoped for is to rid the area of all homosexuals. I found out years later that my dad had uh, practiced homosexuality in the uh, Boise community. It got to be to the point where every day, who's going to be next? One of the police officers that knew him came to him and said, you better leave town because they're coming after you. No matter what is required, this sordid mess must be removed from this community. There weren't many people who were asking, what can the schools do? What can the churches do? Just let's get rid of them. Uh, people wouldn't let my friends play with me anymore. I know they threw rocks at the house and the windows and gunshots were fired. I remember one evening when he was sitting home in the middle of the night with the lights out and a shotgun across his lap. And I think people were looking under their own beds. It is evident that no one is being spared. And uh, maybe it became sort of a witch hunt. And it, it, it probably could have happened in any community.